Triple G here, man. I got a few things uh, I want to speak of. First of all, look how light it is out here. I'm in Florida. Up north, up north, this be full right now. It's like it's like six o'clock. Um, yeah, that's why I say, man, get up early, three o'clock, four o'clock, get your job done so you can get in these truck stops and be comfortable. So you can go and use the bathroom and get you something to eat. But I got a few things I want to touch on um a little bit, man, for y'all. I know a lot of drivers just starting out, a lot of people I know trying to do you know trucking and stuff and i'm gonna give y'all a pro i'm trying to see if i want to give y'all a full pre-trip or a little light pre-trip or what you really need to look for when you're out here i'm going to actually go on a home time with this loads on so i might not be able to do it but i'll probably do it on my way back out in like four days or so but um first thing i want to touch on make sure you gonna have this for your music but don't be driving with these too much man especially on no scale, pass no DOT, because they'll give you a big ticket for these, man. Got to get you a little blue, too. I think this one, like, $90 at Walmart. They got some $50 ones in the truck stop, too. So, yeah, make sure you get your blue, too. Next thing I want to talk about is your rewards cards, man. Pilot Flying J, they got some TA Petrol, but this company don't too much deal with them. Works wonders, man. As soon as you got to fuel up your first time, you're going to grab your car activator, man, so you can start getting your points. The certain amount of gallons you get, you get a shower, free shower. I mean, the points you build up on here, whatever they got to eat in there, you can use to eat. You can buy CB, whatever you need, man. These are necessity. Because if you don't got no money, you can keep eating on these and keep getting points. All right? Get this. Next thing, I know y'all heard about pee bottles. Your companies don't want you to keep pee bottles, but I'm going to tell you, you're going to need to leave one or two on, bro. You, you can't be out here without a piss bottle unless you just want to stop somewhere every time you got to piss. I prefer to sell y'all, man, get off on the off ramp, go over back on the on ramp, pull over to the side, So once you start, you want to get a roll and start, not backwards. I know some people just starting off, they're going to be in a manual. Some in the automatic, some not. I'm in the automatic. If you're in a manual, you just start not. I know you, some people have a hard time letting that clutch catch. And then you'll roll back. You'll be jumping, knock some over in the back, whatever. Easier. On, back on the arm ramp, pull over to the side, pop your brake, neutral, take a piss in your bottle. Now, I'm going to tell y'all, that bottle, you don't plan on using no more, or it's full, whatever the case may be, dump it out, man, at night preferably, behind your drive, um, your drive tires, or behind in the grass somewhere nobody can't smell it, man, because I done did it before, man, left some piss sitting, man, you open that bit, man, it smell like some barbecue chicken, it's not what's up, not what's up. Um, <laughs> another thing, man, I know some people are going to be nervous going on them scales their first time because I was not everybody, but some. It's a piece of cake, man, to just uh follow the signs, man. If they're going to bypass, they're going to bypass, it's going to be a light for that. Whatever you got to do, it's going to be a light. Green arrow here, it's going to be X not to go that way. X not to go this way, green arrow here. If you got to go on the scale, while you want to down, take your buzz out, pull up, make sure you're on there, whatever it say, go. Simple as that, man. Um, I'm trying to see what else I need to talk about. Oh. Oh. I mean, it ain't, it ain't, oh, they got another night driver right there. It ain't too many, um, I know y'all hear these stories about lot lizards and all that. It, it's, man, they, they far and gone, man. Unless you go to Dallas, Dallas is a lot on my there in like up in some part of New Jersey. What I, this is what I know about. I ain't, you know, I don't do north, northwest. I've been in Cali, but I only do the south, southeast. No, that's that's pretty much it. 
So, I mean, just got to conserve your money, man. I know I know you're tired of eating sandwiches and all that. And sometimes I get to that point. I'm tired of suits. There's only so much you can buy if you ain't planning on getting no cooler or buying a refrigerator for your truck and all that. Like I said again, I'm not out here like that. You know, I just was out here this long. It was when I first came out here, I had stuff bagged up. So I did four weeks. You know, if you plan on doing something like that, living out your truck, by all means, get you a CV, get you a plug-in cooler at Walmart, get you a refrigerator, keep the meat cold, get all that good stuff, man. Um, and just, just be safe out here, man. It's wild out here, man. Wow, me personally, I don't drive at night. I know I'm at a sit there in my other video. So, 3, 4 in the morning. Just pretty much, man. I think I did about 571. I don't try to I don't try to rush it, man. Light, light. I try to trade light as possible, bro. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to put a link in the other description about my uh my Bluetooth, man. Planetronics. Planetronics.com. You got some cheap ones, man. It's, it's cheap to ship. Three to seven days. Mine came in like four days. I mean, my other uh, cord to charge it. Because I had lost my other cord. So, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. But I ain't got too Damn, my bad, y'all. Uh, I ain't got too much more for y'all, man. Um, just let me know if you want to know anything. I mean, I've been with three different over-the-road companies, two local companies. So I've been, I've been around, man. But like I said, man, common dude. I ain't trying to do this too, too, too heavy. Be out here all these weeks, man. Just like two weeks after this, I'm gonna do like two weeks and then go home for, um, I don't know, four days to a week, bro. I got, I got a little baby, so. Yeah, man, this ain't what's happening. Oh, in case y'all didn't know, too, you ain't got to wash your clothes at no truck stop, man. Your terminals is free. Should be, all of them. All your terminals free. Just bring your washing powder and stuff. You good. So, that's pretty much it for me, man. Anything else y'all want to know, get it, man. Ain't got no Twitter, Facebook, none of that. Um, I'm going to work on that. Uh, I'm just getting to this thing, and, you know, just for y'all, man. Y'all get at me, this triple G, I'm going. Man.